this is uh, this was one of my coaches, and uh, I learned. Oh, I was cleaning my teeth while you were saying. That. Well, we can start over. <laughs> no, no, it's okay. It doesn't get better. Hold on. <laughs> Let me. Is this on right? Because sometimes it. There. Good. Okay, I'm ready now, John. <laughs> so this is Jack Nicholson, and. Uh, well, wait a minute. You know, you keep telling me about the good life, John, because it makes me want to puke. <laughs> Actually, this is Pat Fraley, and he was one of my coaches. Uh, I learned creating characters back before I even got started in this business from, from his audio. But, well, they were audio tapes at the time. Now they're CDs. And now they were the little things that are called cassettes. <laughs> You can find them in antique shops now. Yeah. Uh, but he also did uh, an audiobook course that I took, which uh, helped me book my first audiobook, which I won't ever do again because I'd rather, much rather do trailer and promo. It's, it's yeah, quicker. It's not, it's not a journey for everybody. It's a marathon. So yeah. uh, what all what all do you offer them? What as far as of, teaching? Uh, yes, teaching. Well, I have events that I take around the country on weekends. It's all on my website, patfraley.com. But what I've been excited about and doing since January is putting together home study courses. So I can teach people in Des Moines and Kansas and all over the right. country and UK there are five lesson course studies and now on my website just recently you can go shopping and take what you want. Character voice, accents, voice study, audio books right. and uh, just patfreely.com and they're available and they're less expensive than these sessions. Right. I mean you know I don't want to go to heaven <laughs> saying I only taught people don't with worry. money. <laughs> not not good. So these are reasonable. But you you do you do group workshops as well as as well as one on one. Coaching. Yeah, I'll go in and do an event. I'm going to Chicago next. I'm going to Dallas uh, September uh, 27th. I take ten people, right. and we do various things. We're going to do mix down meltdown, which is all recording, and then we mix it with the sound right. and and the. Uh, music and sound effects and we get to hear it back in context nice. which is so fun and uh, one of the things you do uh, with uh, with the comedy side of things he actually brings guests with him uh, yeah some very famous people you would know Brad a, Garrett Brad Garrett um, sometimes it's uh, the water buffalo <laughs> that's good you'll have to do that for him he loves impressions um, Ed Asner um, 608 yeah you'll get that if you watch the rest of this video <laughs> but, but uh, yeah, I, I always try to have a guest that's meaningful if I can get hold of them. Sometimes on the road, it's me and uh, sometimes like Tim Dadabo in Chicago, right. wonderful talents. But when I'm in L.A., I try to get somebody like this. I, this weekend, I have uh, Meredith Lane, who is the casting queen at Nickelodeon. Oh, so nice. she'll tell them what I, she wants, and I'll help get them there. So nice. that, I think that's important to people get to work with uh, people right at the top. Right. And with audiobooks, he brings in the amazing Scott Brick. We and I, teach together. Who was, the, uh, who was the other guest that you had at the uh, Atlanta when I went to? you remember her name? Like Jocelyn. Yeah, she was, a, she was a writer and producer, and uh, yeah, yeah, she was interesting. So you mean yeah. you're getting you're getting more than just one coach at some of these events. Yeah, so. I need to lean on somebody better than I am. I'm only as... No, we're just doing an interview. <laughs> but thanks. Thank um, you for interrupting. Yeah, really. Thank you. It's good. It's now loose. you know it's live. Hey, you want slick? Don't get John and me. Okay. We're, we, we, if we get slick, we fall over. The unpolished voice. Right. So uh, I forgot what I was saying, but uh, Jocelyn. That's what we're Well, yeah, Jocelyn was a guest, and uh, I think. Oh, I can't remember, but I always. Oh, I know what I was going to say. I'm only as good as the elbows I'm rubbing. So ah, I always gotcha. work with people better than I. Yeah. Now uh, uh, he doesn't all. I mean. You might be wondering, why would I want to, to work with Pat Fraley? Talk about some of the credits that you worked on. How, how long have you been doing this? I mean, he's worked on Bra I mean, Brave Star, for crying out loud. He was Krang in Ninja Turtles in the original I series. I was Krang in Ninja Turtles. Yeah. Uh, oh, I don't know. Men in Black, I was the worm guys. Right. Got a cup of java, got a light of grande. That was a great series. Um, G.I. Joe, I was yep. Ace. I mean, a lot of stuff back in the day, and recently I did uh, the Lego movie. Yeah. And uh, September 26th, uh, Box Trolls comes out. Oh yeah, so my play, buddy Steve Bloom is in that uh, that movie. So yeah, that's that looks D really cool. D Baker is, and, and I yeah. play. I, I met play. I met Elle Fanning, who plays the uh, the young the young lady. She was Cinderella. Did you? And, yeah, she's very very sweet. I play Sweets, who is an old um, box troll who has dentures. Uh, and I also met ben, ben Kingsley, who was in that movie. Oh, yeah, Ben. Was, that, me made, ben. that made me nervous. <laughs> hanging up, hanging with Ben. Yeah. <laughs> sir, sir Ben Kingsley. Yes, sir. Uh, so, how many years is that? How many years experience? Combined? Forty. Forty-one. Forty years. You're getting forty years combined experience yeah. in, a, in a coaching session with this guy. And well, I, I wouldn't be here today if it wasn't for this guy. One, was, of, one of a handful of people that is responsible for my career. So. No, that's that's nice to hear because it's a wonderful career. 
I was with Ed Asner yesterday, and I said that the two of us together represent a hundred years of performing, wow. but eighty years looking for a job. <laughs> and that's true. And he replied with, "Hate is what drives me." <laughs> Six oh eight. Shut up. You sound like the BBC. That's you know, I actually, me. I actually got a good compliment with him because, uh, and I haven't recorded this part yet. But, uh, when I got to meet him in person, one of my favorite characters he did was Granny Goodness from the Superman uh, animated series, as well as some of the movies. And I was like, I love Granny Goodness. He's like, you know, I love Granny Goodness, too. Not a lot of people tell me that. <laughs> and she's an evil alien grandma. Why wouldn't you want to voice that character? <laughs> we did gargoyles together. I, I've done everything with him. A play, movies, TV, audiobooks. It's uh, 30 years now that he's been my mentor and, and yeah, you'll, friend. You'll more than get your money's worth for this guy. So, And what was that site again? One more time. What, what? The, your website, where, where they can find all this wonderful information. That's patfraley.com.